Or just how to appreciate his particular point of view. When the British aircraft carrier Bulwark went to the rescue of tanker crews in distress in the Gulf of Oman, her helicopters had a leading part to play in the drama. The 20,000-ton Liberian tanker Malika was on fire after being in collision with a smaller French ship. Many of the injured, saved from the oil tankers by the work of men from Bulwark and other Royal Naval and merchant ships, were brought back to the carrier by helicopter shuttle service. This film has been enlarged from pictures taken in the heat of the moment, so to speak, by a member of the ship's company. In addition to this rescue work, naval parties were to be put aboard the tankers in a successful effort to master the fires. It was a tough assignment for all concerned, and the job was especially difficult in the case of the Malika. The blaze virtually cut the ship in half, and the firefighting parties had to work separately at either end. They kept in touch by radio. This was the very unpleasant state of affairs they had to face when they went aboard the tanker. And later, HMS Bulwark's captain decided to take Malika in tow. A line was fired across, and a boat took more men to the tanker to help in securing the towing line. During the operation, Malika actually grazed Bulwark's stern, but no serious damage was done. In addition to saving life, the British carrier was finally engaged in a fine job of salvage, as Malika was towed away towards Muscat. <laughs> 